Welcome to our channel. The world is full of surprises and mysteries, with breathtaking landscapes, unexplained phenomena, and ancient wonders that continue to puzzle scientists and explorers alike. From glowing blue volcanoes and boiling rivers, to lost civilizations hidden beneath dense jungles, our planet holds countless secrets waiting to be uncovered. Strange and rare occurrences, like bioluminescent waves, moving stones in the desert, and deep-sea creatures from the abyss, remind us how much is still unknown. Every corner of the Earth offers something extraordinary, proving that no matter how much we discover, there will always be new mysteries to explore. Today, we dive into one of these wonders, Kawaijin, a volcano unlike any other. Hidden in the heart of Indonesia, Kawaijin is not an ordinary volcano. Instead of black smoke and red lava as most volcanoes do, it releases blue flames and electric blue lava. This rare phenomenon occurs when sulfur-rich gases escape, ignite upon contact with oxygen, and burn at extreme high temperatures, creating an eerie glow. Located in eastern Java, about 21 kilometers from Raung, Kawa Ijin lies in a highly active volcanic region. While it appears like lava, the blue glow is actually burning sulfur. The volcano's fumaroles release molten sulfur, which, with a low melting point of 115 degrees Celsius, 239 degrees Fahrenheit, ignites easily when exposed to the volcano's intense heat. By day, it looks yellowish, but at night, it burns neon blue. This stunning yet dangerous process makes Aijin one of the world's most unique volcanic sites. Kawa Aijin's origins trace back 300,000 years when magma from the Indo-Australian plate pushed to the surface. Over 240,000 years, explosive eruptions built a 22-kilometer wide stratovolcano reaching 3,500 meters, 11,500 feet. Around 60,000 years ago, a massive eruption caused the volcano to collapse, forming a 20-kilometer wide caldera. New volcanic cones emerged within this crater. Biao erupted 50,000 years ago, followed by Pendu, standing 800 meters tall. The current Ijen cone began forming in 640 BC, growing 900 meters above the caldera floor. Since 1796, Kawa Ijen has erupted 10 times, mostly through phreatic explosions, where superheated groundwater triggers violent steam blasts. The last magmatic eruption was in 1817, with the most recent steam-driven eruption in 2002. Kawa Ijen's most dangerous feature is its acidic crater lake, the world's largest, with a pH of 0.3. This toxic turquoise lake emits sulfurous gases like hydrogen sulfide and sulfur dioxide, which can be deadly in high concentrations. Despite the harsh conditions, hundreds of sulfur miners extract solid sulfur daily, carrying up to 90 kilograms, 200 pounds on their backs along steep rocky paths, often without protective gear, exposing themselves to extreme toxic gas levels. Visitors must wear gas masks to avoid serious respiratory issues. If Aijin erupts again, it could trigger explosions in the crater lake, releasing superheated steam, ash, and debris. Given its history, future eruptions could occur anywhere in the caldera, causing pyroclastic flows, lava bombs, and landslides. Despite its dangers, Kawa Ijen remains a breathtaking natural wonder attracting tens of thousands of visitors annually. The best time to visit is May to September, when the weather is clearer and rain is rare. And that wraps up our journey into the mysterious Kawa Ijen, a place where science and nature collide in the most breathtaking way. The world is full of wonders, 
and Kawa Ijen is just one of many that remind us how little we truly know about our planet. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more incredible stories from around the world. Thanks for watching, and until next time, keep exploring the unknown.